Yo guys, welcome back to another video. We hit 10,000 subscribers. I wanted to make a little bit of a channel update slash big thank you to you guys for all your support that you've shown me and the channel through these past couple of years. 10,000 subscribers is a big milestone for me. My goal is 100K. I believe we can get there. And I wanna make a video in thanking each and one of you guys for subscribing and supporting me and the channel and everything that goes on here at John Drives and J Speed Racing. So if you're new to the channel, I'm Jonathan Pride, AKA John Drives. And so this video is gonna be kind of a bit of a channel update along with the big thank you. And we have a giveaway. I've done giveaways in the past for the E36 Barn Find build, but I wanted to do one today day to kind of give you a little token of my appreciation a little thank you of all the support you guys have shown me i'm going to do that at the end of the video so make sure to stay tuned for that i think we're on track for 100k we can definitely get there we got some good content planned it's it's been kind of a journey for sure i'm going to get into the channel update here in a quick second but it's been a journey i've learned so much with filmmaking and channel and balancing uh, all a bunch of different life stuff with making youtube it's like another part-time job you put in so many hours behind the scenes but I love it. I don't do it for the numbers. I do it because I love it. And I love connecting with you guys and kind of sharing what I love to do and my passion. So with that being said, again, big thank you to you guys so much for all your support. It means so much to me and I'm excited to see where this takes us and I think we can go pretty far with it. So now time for the channel update. I'm gonna go chat about some cars, chat about some plans and I'm gonna try to make this as concise as I can to make it interesting for you. So first off, we have my white E36 here in the back. This is my very, very first drift car. I'll link the playlist right up here if you wanna check out this car and the whole build I did on it in the last couple of years. This car has mainly just been chilling. It runs great, drives great. I don't have too many huge plans for it as of now. Um, it's a stock motor, stock everything, but it is a full drift car, so I don't really drive it on the road, but I do plan to give it a little bit of love someday as far as over fenders and some refreshing and making it look a little bit better. Cause if you look, it's, it needs some paint and stuff like that. This car works. I'm going to leave this as is for now. Me and Andy like to street drive them and make cool videos and maybe do some cool Condor speed shop upgrades to it here eventually. Now moving on to the beloved barn find this. I know you guys love this car and as do I, she's going to be getting some love here soon actually. So popping the hood of this E36 is a stock M52 engine. Um, it does run and drive. I actually fired it up the other day, which is big, big news after it's been sitting. I need to go ahead and put a different radiator in it because this one's actually incorrect, along with my electric fan. And then figuring out like my math and little vacuum lines down here. I need to clean this up, clean all the wiring up, make sure she runs freaking minty fresh. And that way we can actually turbo this car. At some point, I'm not gonna give you a timeline because my timelines change, but overall she's not too shabby. Again, I'll link a playlist right up here if you guys wanna come watch this build. So she will be getting a turbo. That's been the plans. I have most of the parts sitting over there. What's been in the way from these fun turbo E36s is my drifting and kind of what I really love to do, which is drive. So my name is John Drives for a reason. I do love to actually drive more than I love to build cars. I love to do both, but unfortunately I like to drive more. So this past six months or so, I've mainly been taking priority of driving as much as I can. Uh, unfortunately, that means putting some of these fun projects that I love to make videos and kind of mess around with, and I know you guys really like, on the back burner. So my S13's mainly been taking priority. It's been a struggle keeping that car alive and being able to go out to drift events. I'll link the playlist here if you guys wanna check that out. I've done a lot of good driving in that car, actually going out here in two days to drift one more, one to two more times this year, and then the off season will be among us. I'm not gonna get into too many details on that car, give you a quick chat of what is going on and maybe some future plans with it. So the S13 drift car, this thing is a full spec drift car, it's all, cut out and tubed and has a fuel cell. It's not a street car at all. You can't literally drive it on the street. It sucks to even drive it two feet, um, but it's it's a race car. It's got a 6.0 LS in it with an LQ9 iron block, big O intake and stuff. As of now, this car actually does work really well, but in the off season, I will be actually hoping to take it all down to the shell and then repaint it, put a new body kit on it and refresh like the engine and a few other things. It is pretty beat, it's kind of ugly, needs some love, but it works now, so I'm gonna leave it until I get my S14 back. But it should be done here in about a month. So the S14 is my other drift car that I had. Uh, I painted it gray, I'll link that playlist here if you guys wanna check it out. I'm not a huge 240 guy, but it just makes sense to drift them with all the aftermarket support and knowledge people have of drifting 240s. So once that car is done with its wiring down in Texas, I'm gonna get it back. I'm gonna have to go over the car, finish it up, and dial it in a little bit. That will probably happen here in the next couple months. And then once that car is set and being able to go out to an event, 
I'll tear the S13 down and rebuild that car. It's currently dark outside right now, but daily driver Mustang. I know I've made some videos on this car. I, I absolutely love this thing. So much fun daily driving it. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna touch it, honestly. I'm not gonna touch it because I don't wanna mess it up. And it's got a warranty and it's fun. And that's what a daily driver is supposed to be. I'm not supposed to go too crazy with it as of now, but maybe one day. Peeking from the dark over there, we got a pair of V36s. This one, I'm gonna sell, cause it's junk. This one, I'm gonna revive, and I'm actually gonna buy another one to replace the silver one. And we're gonna do some gravel tandem drifting here in the fall time, because we don't have any drift season. Drift season will be over. So we take these two junky E36s and go drift in a gravel parking lot. If you missed those videos, I'll link it here as well. Giveaway time is amongst us. It is time to get to the giveaway. 10,000 subscriber giveaway. There will be three winners, as I said. Unfortunately, I think I'm gonna have to have this US only. I know it sucks because I have a lot of guys over in other countries that always support me and stuff. Three prizes, first winner is going to get a BMW car wash kit, I believe is what it's called. I'll put a picture here on the screen. This is a really cool like BMW manufactured car washing kit. It comes with all this cool interior, exterior, wheels, all this stuff. Uh, make sure you don't use the sponge because sponges are junk, so throw the sponge away and use a microfiber. Really cool kit. That kit will go to winner number one along with a BMW t-shirt. I'm gonna give you guys a selection. You can go over to BMW's website and choose which one you want from their site. And just let me know and I'll go ahead and ship it out to you. The shirt and the car washing kit will be prize number one. There will be two more winners and the second two will both be getting the same prize, which are the shirt I'm wearing right now, which is this shirt that I actually had made. It is an E36 shirt with E36 front end on the front. In the back it says 36 with a J Speed logo on the back. That's what I'm wearing right now. You can see it on me. Really soft, I love these shirts. I will actually put these up on the website. So if, so if you wanna buy one, I'll go ahead and link it down in the description below and uh, you can pick one up for yourself if you're an E36 fan. I designed it myself, I really like it and um, I get a lot of compliments on them. The second and third place prize will also get a J Speed Racing Launch Edition shirt. These were the first shirts I ever had made. It's my J Speed Racing Launch Edition logo with the J Speed Racing Drift logo on the back. So you'll get one of these and one of these shirts along with the big sticker pack I'll send out. With a bunch of J Speed Racing stickers, I'll throw those in with it, um, whatever I can find. So the way to enter, you have to be subscribed. Also, you gotta like this video and comment down below. Tell me what you think of the channel down in the comments and that will get you entered. I will choose the random comments here in about, let's say, let's say a week from whenever this video is posted. I'll go ahead and go YouTube live and I'll choose three random winners and contact you either through Instagram, my DM. If you don't follow me on Instagram, make sure you hit me up, John underscore drives. Also, if you're on TikTok, John underscore drives as well. I do a lot of cool drifting stuff on there. Little giveaway for you guys. So a week from today, make sure to just keep an eye out for that. The winners will be chosen via YouTube live. Just a little way to say thank you for all your support that you've shown me. Also, one more thing. If you can see that E36 flag up in that corner, we have those on the website as well. Uh, if you want one, go ahead and check them out. Also, J Speed Racing Flag, if you want one of those, go check it out. I think they should be on the site by the time this video is up. 10,000 subscribers, guys. I cannot believe we've hit 10K. Really gets me excited. I am thrilled to see where we're gonna go from here. All right, everybody, that is gonna do it for the channel update and the 10,000 subscriber giveaway. Make sure to get your comment in down below. There's the shot of the E36 flag, and there's the J Speed Racing Flag. I love these flags. If you guys wanna send anything into the channel as a new flags or something for the shop, I do actually have a PO box. I'll link it down in the description if you wanna send something in. That'd be much appreciated and we would definitely get it in, in one of the videos. That is gonna do it guys. Make sure to hit that thumbs up and subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next video.